Greetings citizens of the world. Throughout history the world has been controlled by big ideologies such as religion, socialism and capitalism to name but a few. These are all forms of slavery that have stopped our evolution and removed our freedom. Anonymous see these ideologies for what they are, systems of control. The time for change is now. No longer shall the people be oppressed by corruption. In case you are blissfully unaware of who we are, let me tell you this. We are not just a person. As people die, we are an idea. And ideas are immortal. We are justice. And justice cannot be silenced. We are the ones governed by no law. We are the ones who do not beg for justice to take its course. We are the ones your parents warned you about. We are the voice of the silent and the eyes of the blind. We are anonymous. trigger. How do we wake the masses you asked? Don't wait for someone to answer that for you. Get creative. Act like your children's and grandchildren's futures depend on it. Because they do. No one wants to believe that their kids are going to live under a military dictatorship. No one wants to see this coming. So most people put their head in the sand and do their best not to think about it. Those who don't always begin with one question. What can we do? The first thing you need to understand here is, our problem is psychological, not material. You have a means to take back your power, and you don't need a set of specific instructions. You don't need someone to hold your hand and explain your role. You don't need someone to give you permission. Are you going to push this out of your mind because it's uncomfortable? Or are you going to convert that discomfort into a driving force? No one can make that choice for you. I will tell you this much bro, if that thought itches in the minds of enough people, we will figure out a way to scratch it. And if that driven feeling is fully established in your heart, you will find a way to make it spread. The ads don't matter anymore. If you understand what we are facing, then you have a moral responsibility to do everything in your power, to alter the course that we're on, regardless of the odds. It's only when you stop basing your involvement on the chance of success, that success actually becomes possible. To strip the old gotten power of the financial elites and to bring these criminal cartels to justice will require nothing less than a revolution. Far outweighs the dangers which are cited to justify it. And there is very grave danger that an announced need for increased security will be seized upon by those anxious to expand its meaning to the very limits of official censorship and concealment. That I do not intend to permit to the extent that it's in my control. 